Let's start at the top level. As of today, the model and forecasting site 538 estimates a popular vote advantage of three points for Vice President Kamala Harris over former President Donald Trump. Their model shows Harris with 278 electoral votes, slightly above the 270 needed to win the White House. All of this, of course, translating to a win probability of 55% for Harris to Trump's 45%, which is analogous to flipping a quarter that looks exactly like a regular quarter, but with slightly more weight shifted to one side. Diving a little deeper, these are the seven closest states in the country right now. Uh, today, Trump has a slight edge in three of them, Georgia, North Carolina, and Arizona. Us, uh, Harris has an advantage in four, Pennsylvania, Wisconsin, Nevada, and Michigan. And her advantage in those states is a bit wider, which is why she is the slight favorite in the overall forecast. In Arizona, 538 forecast Trump with a one point advantage over Harris in the model margin. Uh, recent polls, we have five of the most recent polls. Trump leads four of them and with fairly comfortable margins uh, showings as well. Uh, Emerson plus three, RMG Research here plus four. The last lead for Harris was a three points in uh, a high ground poll that was conducted in late September. Now, uh, of course, 538 is just one election modeling site that people are watching this year and all of them are updated when new polling comes in. So expect at least some movement in the next few days. With a look inside the numbers, I'm Garrett Archer, ABC 15, Arizona.